Savitri Book 11 The Book of Everlasting Day Canto 1 The Soul's Choice and the Supreme Consummation Page 696 the form of things had ceased within her soul invisible that perfect godhead now around her some tremendous spirit lived mysterious flame around a melting pearl and in the phantom of abolished space there was a voice unheard by ears that cried choose spirit thy supreme choice not given again for now from my highest being looks at thee the nameless formless peace where all things rest in a happy vast sublime cessation no an immense extinction in eternity a point that disappears in the infinite felicity of the extinguished flame last sinking of a wave in a boundless sea end of the trouble of thy wandering thoughts close of the journeying of thy pilgrim so accept o music weariness of thy notes o stream wide breaking of thy channel bands the moments fell into eternity mistakes recognized may never be renewed grant lastly that his actions may be the exact and sincere expressions of his proclaimed ideals the moments fell into eternity but someone yearned within a bosom unknown and silently the woman's heart replied thy peace o lord a boon within to keep amid the roar and ruin of wild time for the magnificent soul of man on earth sarva bhutastha matmanam sarva bhutani chatmani ikshate yoga yukta atma sarvatra samadarshana yo ma pashyati sarvatra sarvanjamai pashyati tasya ham na pranashyam 
stillness of her thoughts immeasurably the woman's nature spoke thy oneness lord in many approaching hearts my sweet infinity of thy numberless souls <laughs> 